Good morning, Seabrook. It's Tuesday, March 7th, and today is National Cereal Day. Grab a spoon and a bowl and enjoy your favorite cereal for breakfast, lunch, and dinner today. What is your favorite cereal? I'm Jessica. And I'm Emanuela. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Want to join an Explorica trip for next year? The Art Department is sponsoring a trip for February 2024 to Montreal and Quebec. See Ms. Hopp in room 142 if you are interested. Sign up is now. Are you interested in joining the Clarksburg debate team? Competition is, fi is finished for this school year, but we are looking for new members who want to compete in the fall. Please join us in room 206 at lunch on March 14th to find out what the debate team is all about. If you can't make lunch, come see Mrs. Wessel in room 206 to get a Zoom link and join us for the online interest meeting at 6 p.m. March 14th. The Protect the Future Club is organizing a toy drive for the University of Maryland Children's Hospital from now until Friday. New items like figurines and activity books are accepted. Make a child's day by dropping off an item in room 222 or in the main office. NHS members, you have a meeting tomorrow. NHS is meeting in their service project planning committees. Any questions, contact your service chair. Now let's go to, now let's go to weather. Good morning, Columbus for Abba Law. Here's your daily weather. Today will be light snow this morning with a high 52. It's falling clear skies in the afternoon. Tonight will be clear skies at below 29. Tomorrow will be mainly sunny with a high 51. I saw water today, coyotes. Then Matt, now Mac and now some stuff for a short video. Fentanyl's in everything out there now. These aren't the drugs of 10 years ago. Illicit fentanyl has 50 times the strength of heroin. As little as two milligrams can be fatal. Before Stephen and Andrew passed, I didn't really know anything about fentanyl. Many young adults have never heard of illicit fentanyl. This increases the risk of death through experimentation. They are putting it in everything to make all their drugs more potent and more addicting. Illicit fentanyl is being used to make counterfeit prescription pills, as well as lace drugs of all kinds. They were good kids that made an, an innocent mistake. Young people are supposed to learn from their mistakes, not die from them. He thought he was being safe. He took one Percocet, and now he's dead. This is a drug like we've never seen before. People are being poisoned through deception. They think they're buying one drug, but receive another that kills them. Fentanyl is the number one killer for people ages 18 to 45. Anyone, anywhere, anytime. Fentanyl kills. For more information, please visit matthewsvoice.org or facingfentanylnow.org. Juniors, the GBTLA Saturday Schools Crash Course to College is held every Saturday from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. Get started on your college applications now with Mrs. Somerville. It costs $85 or $40 if you qualify for farms. Limited space is available. For more information, please see Ms. Somerville in the Career Center. Are you a lover of cats? Help the Montgomery County Cow Cat Coalition with the rescue cat they support by donating cat treats and cat food. A donation box is outside the main office. The Leo Club thanks you for every little bit helps. Now let's see what's happening in Coyote Athletics. Well, let's go, Seaberg. I'm Dylan. And I'm Ethio, and we got your Coyote Sports Minute. The Washington Wizards are set to play the Detroit Pistons tonight at 7 p.m. Go, Wizards! The Washington Capitals lost against the Los Angeles Kings last night 4-2. Last night, Towson University's men's basketball team lost against Charleston 77-72. Have a great day, Coyotes. I'm Ethio. And I'm Dylan, and now back to the announcements. Juniors and seniors, if you want to find career fulfillment, you need all the information about your skills, interests, and post-secondary options. Stop by the Career Center to register for ASVAB, which will be administered at 7.45 a.m. on Thursday. That is all for today's announcements. I'm Emanuela. And I'm Jessica. And stay safe, Seaberg.